Uh, Daryl? Uh, Arkansas? Yes. Yeah. Well, welcome uh, to Bobby Likas Car Clinic. We have a local shop that is installing hydrogen cells to gas engine cars. Now, I've, had a, I've, hundreds, I've had hundreds of inquiries. Is that a... Uh, yes. These, I mean, they, they're saying it'll increase the mileage by maybe six to eight miles per gallon. Okay, I would say this. If you were, if you were a, a patient of mine and you came in and we looked at a clinical test and, uh, for your health, you, you would want to see the reports that indicate, and of course you won't see words like prove or you won't see words like, you know, those sorts of things, but you, you'll, you'll see in clinical tests where of so many patients, uh, uh, an, a higher percentage of the, of the patients who did this or did this, who took these tests and participated in these tests, uh, saw better results. Uh, I have yet to see a single white paper. I have yet to see a single uh, documented uh, independent lab test for any of these H2. And when you strip H2 from H2O, it uses a, a, it's done by electrolysis. You have to have the energy, and that energy comes from electricity. And the same electricity that can be used to strip that can be used to drive the automobile. And I'll give an example, Daryl. The uh, Ford Motor Company has uh, hydrogen buses. These hydrogen buses they've had on the road for years, but they store so that they can get a range. They store f the hydrogen at 10,000 PSI in very secure storage tanks. So the HOD, or hydrogen on demand, which is the latest rage, you know, there are always things that pop out every time, things that, uh, ideas, and and uh, I won't use the word gimmicks, but uh, but but sales ideas and sales offers, offers uh, that say, hey, if you'll send me $49, I'll send you the plans. You can build one yourself. And then there are other websites that say, if you send me $1,200, I'll send you one of these units and you put it in your car. And there's even yet another one that says, if once you put this unit in your car, the next step would be to use this, some kind of a catalyst that even kicks it up a notch. But I've yet to see any white papers from any known uh, credible, uh, uh, non-interested or, or lab, lab, uh, lab test. Uh, have you seen any such? No, huh? And I, when I heard about it, I told my wife, I said, I'm going to call Bobby Likas and get his take on it. Well, I'm sure that I'll get some uh, flack from the companies, but I will tell you, I, can, I have looked uh, uh, and because I've answered more than 100 emails. And if you'll send me an email, Daryl, not only will I... Well, I'll answer your email personally. I will include a white paper about uh, the hydrogen economy, which hydrogen economy is one of the tools that we're going to, and, and goals that we need to work toward in the future. But I'll just share this with you. Hydrogen fuel cell vehicles require massive infrastructure. I know this is that we're talking about two different things here, but the use of hydrogen as a fuel for HOD indicates and 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 uh, and, and, and implies not in, is implied by the the people that are selling those devices that you can create your hydrogen on demand and you can put it in the mouth of the engine and that will reduce the 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 uh, the use of fuel and it will increase the MPG. I, my my. First question, in addition to show me the white papers and show me the proof, would be who has addressed the check engine light? When and if the check engine light comes on, how is that addressed? And if you, and if you, as you, as you, if you're installing these devices in customers' cars, when that check engine light comes on, what are you doing for the software of that car? And the last question, how does it affect the warranty on the car? When those questions are, are answered, and I, then I'll sign up. That makes sense, Daryl? Appreciate your information. I appreciate your call. 888 227 2546. If you have a comment and you'd like to get in, or if you're offering one of these devices, or if you've installed one of these devices, I welcome you live here on Bobby Likas Car Clinic, so long as you have, other than your opinion, proof. And that proof can be not out of your shop or out of your sales door, but out of a, a lab and or a white paper.